Hello everyone, this is Mazhar Ali and welcome you to my YouTube channel Learning Digitally. Today we are going to be talking about a fascinating and thought-provoking topic, post-humanism. In this digital age, technology is rapidly transforming our world and changing the way we live. And post-humanism is a philosophical concept uh, that explores the impact of technology on humanity and our future. It raises important questions about what it means to be human and how our relationship with the technology is shaping our evolution. So join me on this journey as we delve into the philosophy of posthumanism, its future implications and the challenges it presents to society. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button to stay up to date on all the latest content from Learning Digitally. Also press the bell icon that you may get the notifications of my upcoming videos. Posthumanism is a term that was first introduced in the late 20th century to describe a vision of a future where humans have evolved beyond their current state and have integrated technology into their bodies and minds. This concept was popularized by a group of thinkers and scientists who sought to change the traditional view of humanity and explore new possibilities for human evolution. Posthumanism refers to the uh, belief that human beings will eventually evolve into a new form that is beyond our current state of existence. This new form of existence is achieved through the integration of technology into our bodies and minds, enabling us to surpass our physical and mental limitations. The post-human vision is characterized by the belief that our evolution is not uh, predetermined, but rather is uh, shaped by our choices and the impact of technology on our lives. So friends, post-humanism is an intellectual and cultural movement that challenges traditional views of the human condition and envisions a future where the boundaries of what it means to be human are blurred and the limitations of our physical and cognitive abilities are overcome through technological and scientific advancements. The origins of post-humanism can be traced back to the early 20th century when advances in technology, biology and psychology began to call into question our understanding of what it means to be human. The philosophy of post-humanism is rooted in a rejection of traditional view of human nature and the belief that technology and other forms of advancement can shape our evolution. The post-humanists urge that technology has the potential to augment and enhance our abilities leading us to new stage of human development they also believe that our relationship with the technology is changing the very nature of our existence, allowing us to extend our lives and overcome physical and mental limitations. Future implications of post-humanism are now vast and varied. Some envision a world where humans merge with the technology, creating a new form of existence that is beyond our current understanding. Others imagine a future where artificial intelligence surpasses human intelligence leading to the creation of a new kind of life. There is also the possibility that post-humanism will lead to the development of new technologies and innovations that will have a profound impact on society and the way we live. For example, advances in biotechnology such as genetic engineering could one day allow us to extend our life spans, increase our physical and cognitive abilities, and even alter our genetic code to create new forms of life. Meanwhile, advancements in artificial intelligence, robotics, and other areas of technology could transform the way we work and live, leading to new possibilities for exploration and discovery. While post-humanism presents many exciting possibilities, it also raises a number of challenges. 
one of the main challenges is ethical and moral is the integration of technology into our bodies and minds raises questions about the limits of human enhancement and the role of the technology in shaping our evolution additionally uh, there are concerns about the potential impact of post humanism on society and the potential for technological advancements to lead to new form of inequality and discrimination the basic doctrines of post humanism reject the idea of a fixed human nature and embrace the notion that humans can and should strive to transcend their current limitations through the use of technology biotechnology and other means this perspective challenges traditional views of human superiority and urges that our species is not the end point of evolution but rather a transitional phase in the development of more advanced forms of life so friends post humanism is a complex and thought provoking concept that has the potential to shape the future of humanity in profound ways while it presents many exciting possibilities it also raises important questions about the limits of human enhancement and the role of technology in shaping our evolution as we continue to explore the implications of post humanism it is important to consider its impact on society and to think critically about the future we want to create and that's a wrap on our discussion on post humanism we have explored the philosophy of post humanism its potential future applications and the challenges it presents to society it's clear that post humanism is a complex and multifaceted topic that raises important questions about our relationship with the technology and what it means to be human whether post humanism will shape our future in positive or negative ways remains to be seen but it's an important conversation to have as the technology continues to play an increasing prominent role in our lives so friends i hope you enjoyed this video and learned something new if you liked what you saw don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to my youtube channel learning digitally for more content like this and don't forget to press the bell icon that you may get the notifications of my upcoming videos and as always let me know in the comments what you think about post humanism and if there are any other topic you would like to see thanks for watching and see you in the next one